Hi everybody, this is uh, David Kino with Basecamp Trading and we had some really uh, good trading today in the trading room. Caught the bottom in SPX and a lot of our times our, our traders can see a directional move but they always hesitate to call the turn. They don't know where in the move um, is the highest probability of catching a reversal. Now we had a really good example of how to use our new indicator VSI. Uh, you can see that um, SPX had a lot of consolidation until about 1030 and then all of a sudden we took a break lower to the point where we entered an oversold status as well as uh, incurring a, a low volume uh, dot right here on the five minute chart. So this is the low of the day. The next bar, we got a low volume uh, signal and then we start to immediately bounce higher. We rate, we make roughly a 50% retracement and then we pull back right in the vicinity of the previous low. So this is a double bottom. We check momentum. We see that it is clearly a bullish divergence because the indicator line is at minus 45 on the first low and minus 32 on the second low. Clearly also the histogram bars are much bigger on the first low than they are on the second low. And then to top it off, we touch the oversold um, 30 level and we get a low volume signal on the reversal candlestick bar. Uh, I can't think of any more ways for the market to throw you the signal that this reversal is going to work. We take that signal and then we bounce right back to the 50%. Again, sometimes it's not super clear when we get a reversal, but if you're watching the signals and you're looking at them and seeing that their signals are tying in with each other, that it supports your decision and makes it really easy for you to catch a reversal. In this case, uh, a, a very nice five or six point move in SPX and that kind of uh, move is uh, well over $350, uh, $400 a contract. So again, nice bounce in SPX, clear signal from VSI.